Danella Yeptin Chai, and I'm the founder and CEO of Full Suite. So at Full Suite, we mind your business so that you can focus on running it and growing it. So I, I spent a lot of time living and working outside the Philippines before moving back here. And when I did, I was really frustrated with uh, the pace and way things were happening. And so Full Suite was started to help other entrepreneurs really take away the burden of tedious admin work uh, so that they could focus really on the task at hand, which was you know sales and marketing or whatever they were really good at to grow their business. And you know, every day we bring in the inspiration of efficiency and how other things are done outside the country so that one day you know, we could elevate the way things are done in the Philippines. At Full Suite, we offer you transparency, time, and energy. We actually give those back to you because we are the ones doing a lot of the administrative work for you. And also, as we get to know you as clients, we also offer you the value of trust because we find you the best service providers to help you at every stage of your business. So yeah, there are many people who do what we do, many companies, and what differentiates us from the rest are two things. One is technology, and two is, I would say, language. Technology, we use a platform uh, actually developed by Spectres so that we can monitor the progress of your projects and also help us find you the best service providers. And then language, by that I mean we make it make things simple and easy to understand. You know, it, we avoid uh, legal jargon or at least we try to make it translated so that it's more understandable to the business owners and applicable to how you do your business. Once again, I'm going to emphasize technology as a core, how do you say, pillar of our business. It offers us efficiency and transparency so that we can show you every step of the way um, of a project that we're working on for you. And then also efficiency because, of course, business processes are much faster. We, we upload everything to the cloud. Uh, we, we, set, we communicate um, via technology. And so ideally, it helps you build a better business practice also. Uh, there's lots of risk always in anyone setting up a business. But I think for us, one of the major things is trust. Uh, because we're handling sensitive information and documents on behalf of other people and also uh, building relationships both with clients and partners, it's all about the trust uh, that we can form with everyone and maintain. And uh, I would, I mean, we've definitely run across problems in the past, uh, slips here and there, and the only thing we can do is to gain the trust and keep at it. Uh, and the best way, once again, is really through the transparency that we really push to have both internally and externally. Okay, so piece of advice. Uh, I would say balance your passion and your priorities. You can have a great idea um, and you know, go at it with all, go for it with all your passion. But if you're also not minding the kind of basic things to run your business, then that idea could fall apart. So every day I would say keep yourself in check or even your team and just check how, how you're doing in terms of you know, making sure you've got basics down, uh, you know, paying bills, uh, paying payroll, uh, even just doing sales calls and then versus you know, whatever your dream goal is um, and what you're chasing with your passion. All right, question from Chrono. Do you think that the currently used attendance tracking and management system is outdated? I do. Uh, I think that in the Philippines, we've now got to move on from pen and paper, bundy clocks, uh, I don't know, even Excel spreadsheets, you know, because there are better, more efficient ways and more accurate ways of keeping track of people's time and attendance. And also, I just have to add, I really think that people should also start trusting their teams to do what they do best. So like at Full Suite, we really practice productivity, you know, like output-based work. So as long as, of course, you're accessible and within reach and you're doing your job, 
that's most important to us than you know kind of tracking time and whatnot but I understand it's important to operations as well so I really encourage all business owners to reevaluate how they um, track time and attendance these days because there are many solutions out there and you can find the best one for you okay and now a question from Uber how does convenience of transportation result to your business productivity? It really helps. <laughs> um, so I, I'm lucky enough not to have to commute so far every time, but by being able to you know, uh, book my rides at a certain time, uh, fix my schedule accordingly, and then plan my routes as well and plan my days, it really helps me just in life in general because I'm able to block off the times that I need to be sitting down somewhere and concentrating. So maybe some days I don't leave my office or the house, but there are also days that I'm all over town zipping around. So it's really fruitful to have a reliable means of transportation that I may not even own.